the platform will ask us to confirm whether we have completed the identification of activity. We'll be moving to the next stage. Identification of area treatment. This stage has three important parts. The first part is analyze. When we click on the construction of a stone peripheral bun tab, the platform provides us with tabs to determine the probable locations for that activity, draw, and the previous geotag data option. When we click on probable locations, the platform gives us rule sets. For example, for bun construction, the rule sets might specify that buns can be constructed in agricultural land and cropland, slope, the slope can be greater than 3 degrees and less than 8 degrees, or it can be greater than 8 degrees and less than 15 degrees. Soil type, the soil can be of any type or we can specify a particular soil type if needed. The platform also provides the possibility to reset the rules, allowing users to adjust the criteria based on their specific needs and local conditions. For certain activities, such as construction, there might be additional criteria. In our example, the platform specifies that for construction activities, the rainfall has to be greater than 600 mm. Then, the graded buns are used to secure this. With all this information, we can now check the probable locations for our chosen activity. The platform will highlight these probable locations on the map based on the applied rule sets.